Um, bear with me while I try and break this down. But let me just start by saying I'm confused, and I'm and I think we have to be honest with our honest reactions. I'm confused. But all because you're confused, does that mean that you have to be hateful? Okay, so Ellen Page is now Elliot Page, who was a woman now she identifies as a guy so it's he and he wants to be viewed as they you see here's my thing but before we just get into the because i want to just look and dissect I want to look and, and dissect his comments. But let me just start by saying this is that anybody who now comes at someone like me because I find this confusing, screw you. Screw you. Now, come for me if I now start being a hateful and say, oh, but you, you, this is so stupid. Why are you, oh, you're so, you're so weird. Then come for me there. But if you're coming for me when I'm like, this is hard for me to get my mind around because, because I was actually about to say, let's not look at her. Because I'm like, that's concept for, okay, you're now she, but you're now he, and you want to be referred to as they. That's new. Like, that, it takes a lot for me to, for my brain to wrap around that, you know? And for me, I, the way I live my life is, I yes, I am spiritual to a sense, but I try and also be logical as well. And things have to so, have got to sort of make sense. But as much as things have got to sort of make sense, oh my gosh, I'm willing to learn. I'm willing to learn because, guys, I'm sorry. I'm not sure that you got the memo. One plus one doesn't always equal to in life. Does not always equal to in life. So please allow me the opportunity to be confused. Please. Um, but let's try and just look at this now. Um. So I want to bring up the um, um, ha, uh, his statements. I want, to, I want to bring up his statements. I mean, this, okay, look. Um, I don't know whether you can see this, but... Oh, damn it. I'm not sure how well you can see this, but I will read it for you. Because I may not be able to read it for you. So... Hi friends, I want to share with you that I am trans. My pronouns are he, they, and my name is Elliot. I feel lucky to be writing this, to be here, to have arrived at this place in my life. I feel overwhelming gratitude for the incredible people who have supported me along the journey. I can't begin to express how remarkable it feels to finally love who I am enough to pursue my authentic self. I've been endlessly inspired by so many in the trans community. Thank you for your courage, your generosity, and ceaselessly working to make this world a more inclusive and compassionate place. I will offer whatever supports I can and continue to strive for a more loving and equal society. Um, so obviously, and then... Okay. And then he then goes on to describe about how many people especially the black and Latin community, trans women have been um, sort of been um, abused and, and attacked and about cancellations and so forth and how she wants sort of, she is proud to be part of the queer community. Um, okay. So, so, so this is my, my thing here. First of all, okay, let, let's okay, let's let's start with hate. 
why do you why do you have an issue with people who are transgender or who are he or she or they okay wow okay that's what they want to be at my main thing is are they harming people you see bunch of whites blacks they, they, they say a bunch of blacks they have issues with them and then they attack them because they're black that's an issue because they are different and they look different you then attack them. that's an issue that's an look like why but my thing is that okay these trans people are they attacking anybody so that issue is on you that you have a you have that problem and you're now pushing out that problem towards hate of like oh, you're so weird why do this bro they, 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 they're, not, they're not harming you just keep it moving now if they now want to enforce these certain ideas to your kids or to people in schools that's why i say oh look relax you don't need to be teaching young kids about transsexual he she no let kids find the find that stuff themselves naturally so that's why i just say look relax no we're not teaching um transgender stuff to six seven eight nine ten year olds that's not happening three no that that, that is not happening no they'll just find themselves in the, in, the, in the real world but here's my thing it's confusing even now, when I'm referencing her, you see, I, I did it again. Because for me, because I know the actor. But I know the actor. Obviously, I didn't watch um, Juno, but obviously, um, Inception, and just seeing her, ugh, seeing him. You see, he, okay, look. This is no, no, no. Look, no, 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 no. The thing here is this: at a point, you were she. So me, seeing as I saw her, I can still say that. See, now I'll call you he. But in X Men, in Inception, and before this day, it's she. So yes, I saw her in those films. And seeing those films, I just grow used to seeing that. Okay, that's a she. Okay, that's a she. 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 The actress. Boom. You know. Pretty good actress and everything, pretty good and everything. But now that you're now coming into a he, I'm like, okay, this will take some time to readjust. <laughs> it will take some, some time to, to readjust. So, because when I first saw the news, I was like, so I was confused. <laughs> I was confused. I was like, okay, so you're. N- it's a leap to go so you're from a she to a he you know and you see my thing here is this is that this is what people one plus one does not equal two let's let's start there one plus one does not equal two we think the world is black and white this that man is man woman is woman this is that but no there are people that just feel differently and you see my thing in life is honesty you have to live your truth you have to live your truth the worst thing in life the worst thing in life is living a lie so if you're a woman who the way you operate the way you think the way you move the things that you like your characterizations are more male you've just got to be real with yourself that i feel male now people will say that no, 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 no. Even if you have these characteristics, you there are like what's it called? How you, you like tomboys? Like you have tomboys. You have some women who are so women and everything. They've got the, the breast, the vagina, and everything, but they have more manly characteristics. They like more things that men like, but they are they still identify as a woman, but they are different. They're not like the regular woman that you would see. But for some people, they may just feel like if no, 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 I am way too far away from. I'm way too far away from womanhood that I need to just go the full years and just be called. Let's be real. Okay. You know what? I th- think for me, I think, look, you have to be real. If, if, if we're not real here, there's, there's no point. So when I saw that, so my question was, 
So have you and look, I'm just putting this out there. I will never ask this, but I'm just putting it out there on this thing called YouTube, this stress. So as Elliot Page, have you now done surgery to have male genitalia? Like, I mean, I don't know because I think for guys becoming when I think they change the genitalia, I think like through surgery or something. I I, I think so. I don't I don't know. I'm just, just all stuff talked out of the head. But my thing is, it's gonna be tough because. But my thing is, don't insult me or come on me or say my lack of understanding. If I find this, I, it's it's confusing. Or if I just say, oh yeah, she is not here, or I referenced this, so she because I've known you for so long as Ellen Page is gonna be. It's a mind twister for me to now view Ellen Page as Ellen Page and just say he. <laughs> because, look, the fact of the matter is this. I don't live in Hollywood. I don't live in Beverly Hills. I don't consider myself a liberal. I told you, I don't consider myself a conservative. I don't consider myself a liberal. I'm not part of both of those sides because both of those extremes is not me. I'm an independent thing. I'm an independent dude. So I am an, I'm an individual. I'm a wolf. I am not part of a group. I'm like, yeah, liberals, liberals. Yeah, pride, pride, pride. Oh, yeah, conservatives, conservatives, you know, virtue signaling. I'm not part of any of those groups. I'm an, I'm an individual. I think for myself. So as an individual, as an independent thinker, the way I view this is, I have no hate towards it. Okay, fine. You want to be called he? Okay, cool. But it's confu- I mean, it's, it's 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 a bit confusing for me because this is new. Okay, because I grew up a certain way. I grew up in Nigeria, very religious kind of background that I sort of veered away from, and I became much more spiritual. You know, great. I have never known anyone who is some homosexual. I've never known anyone who's transgender. See, my sister knows has a few male homosexual friends so she sort of knows i've never i've met somebody who i believe was homosexual but i've never been friends with i've never been in close proximity with transgender or homosexual people so it is hard so this is foreign to me this is new to me so it is hard for me to understand because i'm just like oh yeah man is man woman is woman you know man has the penis Woman has a vagina, boom, and this is how it is. The woman, you know, bears the child, you know, man. So that's just what I know. So, okay, man, but you're now a woman. You were a man before, so I now have to view you as, as she. You were a woman all this time, but now you're a man, and I have to view you as he, and then I have to now refer to you as they, and they is a new pronoun and nice to be brought in. I'm like, but my thing here is this, guys, because 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 when I put out the, the tweet, there the guys are like, no, oh, this is stupid. This is just some weird liberal BS." <laughs> my thing is, guys, I think you don't have to champion it. Nobody's asking you to, to wave the flag of like, "Yeah, man, inclusivity. Yeah, baby, what's up, baby? What up?" But you don't have to be hateful because my thing is that okay, what is Elliot Page doing to ruin your life? To mess up your your life. As I said again, where I draw the line is don't promote this to kids. As adults, you'll be like, that's cool for you. That's fine. There you go. All right. Keep it moving. But see, no. Two lines that, that you draw is don't now just shove this into superhero movies, action movies, because you're trying to make a point and you're trying to latch on to a popular franchise to push forth your agenda. That's why I say no, stop. So that line is that don't just shove it onto popular ma- material that doesn't need to have this shoved onto it and don't shove this onto kids. Please leave. let kids be given the most traditional education possible so once their brains develop, they can because... Children are extremely impressionable. You have to let their brains develop to a point where stuff that, that they receive, they can then decipher what that means. But a six, seven-year-old just accepts everything that's pretty much thrown, thrown at them. So you're just going to mess up them and confuse them. Hence why when you have children who have been um, like um, sexually abused, it scars them for life. It scars them for, for life. You know, so... Um, 
that's the the key thing there so my thing is um it is what it is you know um but i'm sorry i i i reserve the rights to be confused i reserve the rights to be like this is strange now because i say it's strange and it's odd doesn't mean i have any hate towards it but please i reserve the right to be like okay whoa what the heck <laughs> because look how many times did i just reference this? oh yeah let's look at her pain look look, look at she because i'm still saying no i'm like because i'm like well, no, I, I know you but you're wait you're, you're ellen page you were a chick so you're a you, you were a chick now you're a he but that doesn't make sense but you're a chick like so i don't have to call you he and I said, oh, yeah, so his next film, what about his next film? But it's because, of course, but you just don't have to be hate, hateful. And it's, and it's just about learning. And I think maybe it would help if I knew some transgender and homosexual people, which I don't. I don't, you know? So, you know, like, it's, it is what it is. I, I don't. Um, but, yeah, but, guys, tell me what you think. What do you think about this whole thing of um, Ellen, Page going to, Ellen Page going to edit Page? Um, what are your... And please be honest, and then I want to have a back and forth and conversation with you guys about it. So, what is your honest view about transgenders, people going from back from back to forth, male to female, female to male? And then, I'll, and let, let's have a very brutally honest conversation because there's nothing wrong, even if you're hateful towards. It, I want to I want to know why you're hateful towards it so we can have a, a conversation. Because the worst thing in life is that people who let's say have a, a strong reaction reaction to it. Oh my gosh, you're can't you're cancelled? No. Let's have a discussion. Now, if you don't want to have a discussion, then, then that screw you. But if you want to have a discussion while you have an issue with this, oh my gosh, because discussion, only discussion is what we need to have, man. So, guys, remember to subscribe, like the vid, um, and um, let's have let's have a conversation, man. Peace out.